far this month of May? Gosh, I think when the engine showed up in the crate outside of our garage, I was like, yes, we have an engine. Um, and obviously, you know, to have the Chevrolet badge on it means, it means a lot to us. And now the Chevy True Car Machine will be, will be fast in the race. So we're very happy to have them on board and very grateful to them for stepping up. And this morning you made a big announcement with the Girl Scouts of uh, New York. Can you tell us a little bit more about what you have going on with them? Absolutely. So um, it's the 100th year of the girl, the Girl Scouts kind of speak. And uh, they have a, a STEM project, which is basically science, technology, um, engineering, and math. To remember, I'm like so tired, my brain is a bit fuddled at the moment. You're correct, math is correct. Okay, <laughs> Get running on empty. Um, and so, we've done a partnership with them, which is awesome, um, just because it fits really well. You know, IndyCar, it's all about technology at the end of the day. And so, um, I am kind of accepting my role, I would say, uh, as okay. I've never really set out to be any kind of role model, but. I guess it's what you what you are, so you have to accept the responsibility that goes alongside that and I'm trying to do that gracefully and I'm trying to do that well because I see all these little girls and I want them to think that if they want to be engineers, mechanics, PR people, race car drivers, you know, if they love the sport and they want to be whatever they want to be, then they have to know that the world is their oyster and they can absolutely do that. And it's not just in racing, you know, if they see women just following their dreams and they're going to be more inclined to do that so that's great.